John Shepard to assess prospect sites 1 through 4 for sampling and analysis. Repeat, John Shepard to assess prospect sites 1 through 4 for sampling and analysis. Looks like I'm up. Best take the buggy in the garage bay, or the aerial transport on the landing pad up top. Let's go prospecting. Okay, so we've got a choice. That's where they want to actually take the... But we need to go down into the... Um, where it's pointing to right now, the waypoint. To collect the space suit anywhere. Helmet and, dr and also drill sam yeah, sampling tool. So, I, the, the detail is just... Really good though. You've got the showers. Showers are brilliant. This is just great. I mean, out on earth. I mean, really, the thought of everything. It's just. This is what makes something actually worth playing through. Is the is the attention to detail. You can ignore a lot of bugs, a lot of glitches, just because. And the level of detail. We've got the lab here as well. Oops, there's it. So we've got the lab equipment in there. I have no idea if them if we can actually use a microwave. No. That is just that is the only yeah. Now the thing is your character just need to eat and drink. When you're actually playing the space program sort of scenario. So I would imagine they would actually have worked. And I would have actually sort of expected them to work. It's a shock that the door. Yeah, because everything else. Well, that's empty, so what's the point in having the storage crates there if they're empty? Don't know. So there is the uh, sampling tool. We've got in our hand for now. Actually, no, we'll put it here. Don't your hands before. Yeah, as I was saying, normally your character doesn't actually need okay. to eat. That looks like everything. Time to get going. Eat and drink as well as breathe. So... Might just be for this particular scenario. The uh, actual place of this, of this game, as far as I can, you know, as far as I can go, It'll be directly after these first two Europa update scenarios. Just taking a look at the uh, what's new. So we start off with robotics, which is chapter one, and I'll move on to chapter two for manned flights. Well, actually, manned expedition to Mars. I so said this is just Europa. It's just part of the. Uh, one of the, the first of the two scenarios for your update that I'm actually going to play through. Okay, let's hop in. Let's close the door. So that use a power on oxygen supply. Let's just turn the screen on. Put my camera view on. That's the forward view, I think. Yeah, there's the rear view. It's much lower gravity than on Earth, so you have to be careful. The buggy does bounce quite a lot. So you have to just take your time. Try and find it like an, an easier way of. Uh, Go and close the door. Pop the ramp closed. If 
any of you have actually seen the the movie Moon, it reminds me very much of that. Uh, I'll get back in. What's going on? Let's jump up onto the wheel. There we go. The uh, hatch must uh, close by itself automatically. So these are one of the vehicles that you never actually get any training on. So, so the robotics training is about to start with the man train, which is after these two scenarios in this playlist. We do actually see this. I don't know why. So it's very easy to actually roll this. Very easy. So we'll go around and sort of a nice soft sort of gentle slope. So just these are other things. Jesus, nearly. You got to be careful, you see the way it's bouncing. Yeah, I think we should have come on that way actually. Never mind. Try and take slopes as sort of straight on as you can, head on. Don't allow it to sort of roll over. piece of kit off there. Just like that, you have to just be very careful not to do that. That's just an example of what not to do. Yeah, right. Whatever. Right there, just you know, if you see like a ridge or something or a, or a slope, take it head on. There it is, the first one. Got here at last. Yeah, it's a sh there's no ladder there. That's the weird thing about this. There's no way of getting in it, like a. Uh, it's weird that. I don't like they want you to sort of crack your, your helmet. You have to be a ladder on the other side. Oh, no, there is. I'm right, are you? No. There's no, there's no one. It's a two seater. One above, one below. Right, let's get going. I don't think there's a light on. I can't see perfectly well. Why am I, why am I crouched? It's weird. Oh, I know why. Okay, right, let's select the tool. This is a... Basically, it's a, it's a core sampling tool. It's a drill. Not much different than what you take for ice samples. Like the North, you know, the Arctic or the Antarctic. Time to move on to site two. Okay, that's site one done. Just put this back into my. Don't drop it wherever you do. And there's the uh, first car sample. Right, let's head back in. Yes, the hatch does close by itself behind you. Let's 
For some reason, you have to close it manually yourself when you get in. I don't know. Okay, let's go into site two. See a derelict ship, we're getting out of there. I'm not going anywhere near it. you need to actually breathe, well, one of the two sort of ingredients for the fuel. So we'll just pad down here. Just pack a little bit past it. There we go. Close that. As you can see, we use up a lot of oxygen when we're moving around, which is obvious because you, know, as you're moving, you use more oxygen. If you run, you use up a heck of a lot more. So it's actually better if you walk places, even if you're in a hurry. Let's say you use if your oxygen's running out, it's still better to walk. You never get you won't actually get there any faster. Actually, you will do, but you better have a lot more oxygen, so you'll actually die a lot faster. Yeah. Time for site three. Okay, so it's back. So site three is two hundred and eighty-two meters, nearly three hundred meters from where. Let's put the two lines up on the hatch first. If it's actually going to let me, just put this till back. Let's hop in. Okay, like I said, you have to be very careful not to tip the thing over. Very easy to do. As he says, I've got to roll it again. No, 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 no. If it leaves the ground, you've got no steering, you see. So if you bounce up too high... So it may look like I'm actually heading away from that point, or not heading directly straight for it, but that's why you can't just head over rough terrain. If I head over there, it looks really rough. So, I'm going to see if I can ease it over. I'll probably turn it over though. That's why it's got big wheels.
off. Oops. Perfect example of what I was talking about. Whoa, 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 we don't want to go down sideways there. Head on. Just like driving the 4x4, four four, don't let it roll. Very, very easy to just roll this. Is that a ship there? No, it's not. Thank God for that. Okay, let's let it settle. Up on the hatch. Let's head out. Not very efficient, that to be honest. I mean, you 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 actually losing atmosphere inside that cabin every time you open the uh, hatch. Unless it's not pressurized, won't be tossed by. It's not pressurized, but if it is pressurized, then it is a massive waste. Okay, let's drill for the next. Last but not least, Site 4. So where is Site 4? It's 331.8 metres away. But I'm not walking it. Nice there's Jupiter. Damn. Look at that. Yep, let's not go up and waste the air. Just put this drill away. And let's hop in the buggy. Now, it's like I said, you need to be very careful. I've got any lights on this? No, we haven't. I've got helmet light, but that's not the same thing. Now, I think that looks like it's above the uh, rim of the crater. I think we'll head up to the top. Whoa, 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 crikey. What on earth happened there? So because it's also exacerbated the fact that you've, uh, you're actually driving on ice. So not only have you got lower gravity, you've also got ice as well to contend with, so that's another. So we'll just ease over these. That exacerbates the uh, problems of stability. Really? In a crevice? Ah. Up 
whoa, 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 whoa. No, 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 we don't want that. You are joking. Alright, we better park here then. Yeah, so the amount of oxygen you've got, with the amount of air supply you have, is quite sort of misleading. When it tells you when you're actually stood still, actual activity will increase the uh, the drain. You are joking. I'm not going down there. Oh, it's okay, we're alright. Yeah, we should have bought the vehicle. Like I said earlier, if you see a derelict ship anywhere, I'm getting the hell out of here. Oh, I'm looking at those things on my face. Okay, going to the inventory. Grab the drill. Alright, start drilling. Time to head back and see what these samples contain. The heck was that? Is that aliens after me? I need a pulse rifle. Let's get out of here. I don't want to find out. Yeah, don't run there. Oh, jeez. I'm armed. Well, with a drill anyway. The geezers as well. Active vault. Well, active heat vents, I suppose you could call them. Right, let's put the drill back in there. Let's get back to the... Uh, uh, so which way is it? Oh, I see. I don't want to back up over anything and roll this thing over. Six hundred, no, eight hundred and thirty-eight meters, nearly a kilometre away. Just like before. It's not a good idea to rush. Is that way way through just there? Might be a nice easy way through there. Oh, Alright, yeah, it's it. Calm down. Don't go mad. Take yourself off of these sort of bumps. Hey, there's lights on the front. But that's a helmet light. I'm sure, this must have lights on it somewhere. Cam view, we've got yeah, we've got nothing else, we've got no proper lights on this, but it's lights, the rope lights just there. Let's line up. I get stuck now.
plenty of fuel, plenty of oxygen in the tank anyway. Not in my suit though. charge up the uh, oxygen supply in the suit. Oh, sorry, it doesn't. Whoa, 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 alright, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. I mean, it's not, wasn't that much. It wasn't that sharp a sort of climb. Nice and easy. That's it, nice and gentle. sample site. We'll head down this way. safer to go up rather than come down with us, but not to roll it coming down, but uh, I'd still rather take it easy. Because if you roll it, it's game over. I 
don't think this is it. I'll have a go. It's actually much better going up. You take it easy than coming down. Obviously because you've got no you've got more control. Out. I'll get a bit closer. Making sure to stand in front of it, and as you get squashed. There we go. Wait, crikey! Look at that. Damn. Superman, bloody hell. Sorry, huh? You have to hear the heartbeat as well. And the heart rate is at the bottom left corner there of the hood. Quite good, that. So it's about the same gravitational field as uh, at the moment. to uh, stand by. So I never actually looked at the uh, alternative vehicle that you can use for that mission and that's the aerial vehicle. So why on earth can't I close that? Well, there we go. 